Okay guys, welcome to another one versus one on Room 2. I'm Deadly Redcoat and today I'm playing as one of the new Iberian factions that came with the uh, Hannibal at the Gates expansion. Uh, so let's take a look at what you can you can get with this faction. Um, way out here on my right flank is uh, two units of Kel Iberian Cavalry. So I guess they're like a cross between the Celts and the Iberians, I imagine. Um, I have five units of Scutari, the Scutari I, at the front. These guys are in uh, shield wall formation. I'm gonna hit play actually. This enemy believes we are yeah, behind them, I have uh, five units of Scutari spearmen. Behind those, I have my general and this noble cavalry unit. I like the uh, the horse looks pretty decorated, doesn't it? Looks like a girl's horse. <laughs> and I have another Cal Iberian unit. Uh, way down here I have another two Cal Iberian cavalry units. And three units of Iberian skirmishers. These guys are going to perform an ambush for me. Okay, so meanwhile I'm up against the... I can't remember what faction he's got to be honest. I'll have to wait until something comes out from hiding. There we go. Bactria. So he's got three units of mercenary Syrian archers that I caught a glimpse of going down my right flank. Well, down my left flank, but his right. With uh, two units of cav. And he has multiple units moving through the center as well. So what I do is break off my Skutari spearmen, and the spearmen are going to go down the left and my swordsmen are going to go down the middle. I've not got an interest on sitting on the hill waiting to get ambushed so I'm just going to move like that. Yeah these um, Iberian skirmishers they were originally there but I've walked them down and kept them hidden behind this hill and I've walked them all the way through here so so far he has no no clue that I have these Iberian skirmishers so they're still surprise to be uh, discovered for him. Here's where I move forwards on this flank and then I bump into two units of these Hellenic cataphracts which uh, these guys would definitely destroy my Cal Iberians so I pull my Cal Iberians back for now and we're just gonna ignore those uh, cataphracts until I have a better chance to kill them. Okay, so my enemy is on this side of this uh, this road. He's in the trees hidden all along here. And uh, my spearmen are just marching up into position right now. I'm going to launch an offensive across the road. So I've got my cav running through and... Uh, yeah, here's where my cav discovers two Bactrian noble horse units, which are pretty strong. So my Cal Iberians are going toe to toe with them. And the other Cal Iberian unit is fending off the Syrian archers whilst I make the road crossing to minimalize casualties. And I have uh, my Scutari I spearmen running in to assist the fight against the Bactrian noble horse. Oh yeah, I brought my uh, Iberian uh, skirmishers, so these guys are going to throw in. All right. Down to cavalry tactics. Right. Yeah, I end up killing a lot of my own guys, so I pulled this horse unit out, and uh, it's going to go after his archers instead. I'll let the spearmen deal with the cavalry. Here's the counter cavalry tactics on these guys as well, so I'm butchering them right now. Meanwhile over here, his other units are breaking and caught up to some of these Syrian archers. And they are like, they're losing the fight. I had uh, two Bactrian light horse units come out of hiding. They're also being routed right now. And I have this one unit of enemy uh, mercenary Syrian archers just retreating. That I need to catch up to. But I have cavalry like chasing it down, so it's got no chance. 
Okay, so he's died to advance his troops, so I decide to meet him head on, and I'm going to go for the charge. Kill, kill, kill. So my cavalry, I spotted these two units, so uh, let's take a look at his troops actually real quick. So he has two Bactrian and Hillman units, these are very crap, not very good at all. He has two pikemen units, a levy pikemen and a normal pikemen. He has one, two, three, four units of mercenary Syrian archers. So I'm just going to charge straight towards all of them. The thing about his pikemen were they're not in formation. And I do get a charge on them before they get the chance. So, anyway, here we go, charging into the uh, Bactrian Hillman. Boom. And he charges his own man. <laughs> so his Hillman kind of got double charged. Okay, so my Skatari fighting against his pikemen. We have got such an upper hand right now. And we've caught up to his archers and I'm just pursuing them. Meanwhile I have my huge flanking force like coming in to help assist with the rest of the fight. These guys are victorious down here. Okay, my opponent's generals come out now. I'm managing to route off his uh, battery and help him. No problem at all. Uh, we're trying to catch up with his archers. Pikemen again, sliced and diced. Which is good. This is when I used uh, Frenzy, so these guys are going to go crazy. Break both of them Pikemen units and I'll free up these guys to come and help kill off the uh, Hellenic Catherines. My general's attacking his uh, mercenary Syrian archers. And over here, my flanking force caught this uh, unit of Syrian archers who was retreating. And now we're just pursuing what's left of his army through the trees and woods. Here come my cav to make an attack on his general. Okay, so my noble horse, my general's unit, is going to go for a rear charge on his uh, Hellenic cataphracts. So, my noble calf is managing to route off these units almost, so that's good. And over here we kill his general, like any second now. And we caught up to the Syrian archers up here with my other cav unit. So like each of his units has met its end. Whether it was running away or standing and fighting. Yeah, his general died. And then he lose, lost all his cataphracts over here. So that was a decisive victory. Uh, there's the battle results. And that was against a player called Boba. There's uh, Bactria. And there's the two armies we used. Yeah, I definitely like the look of my army better. And uh, to be honest, I don't like these Iberian units. They're not r especially strong. They're quite weak and easy to kill as other factions. But I got lucky, I guess, with the build that he picked. So, anyway guys, thank you for watching and uh, I hope you liked that video. Uh, I'll make some more. I've got some more with the other Iberian faction. Uh, to I've got another video with the other Iberian faction, which I'm going to upload and uh, one with Syracuse and some other factions too. So just stay tuned in and catch you guys later.